All right, Bye, uh, Brian. There goes Brian to do the radio show. We brought in Adam to tell us about the big storm that is going to clobber the Northeast. Now, it's not just one storm. It's two storms that are combining, right? Yeah, we've got uh, what's now snow. We were saw, seeing some of that video. Snow moving through the Midwest currently. There's a low pressure system just off the southeastern coast. They're going to be kind of lifting up, coming together right at the perfect time. And that's when you start to get that nor'easter where it's sitting just off the coast and on the back side of the system, we start to see some of that snow. Obviously, we're pulling up some of these maps. Incredibly cold, and that's cold air what? back. And it, once this moisture runs into that, yeah, it's going to be snow for us. You know, you feel sorry for the people who are stranded at the airports and the people who have to be out and about and have to shovel and all of that. But it's so nice. It's so beautiful. <laughs> Just one more snowstorm. We had such a mild winter. I feel like we didn't get a winter here in New York. It's been incredibly mild. Uh, this is going to be by far the biggest storm we've seen so right. far this year. And actually, maybe if you, we get up into the 20 inch range, which this is possible here, this could be a, a, a near record storm, yeah. at least getting up in that range. The problem with a storm like this is invariably people wind up dying because of a myriad of reasons. They yeah, wind up with good. no electricity. People uh, have that as a problem, but they slide off the roads. And sure. I mean, you don't want to be out on the roads. No. We know this one with the wind 50, 70 miles. Miles an hour. The thing you can't avoid is when you talk about this much wind and this much heavy snow, branches come down, and that's when you start to lose power so and you can cause problems there. There's no chance you'll be off a little bit. We definitely are getting a blizzard. Yeah, we're getting a blizzard now. There's going to be areas where maybe you're in a little bit better shape because I think the snow ranges will be from eight inches up to two feet. So. Yeah. Uh, Hopefully, there's more areas closer to the eight inch range mm -hmm. and less less people dealing with two feet of snow. But, but still, eight inches of snow is a lot of snow. It's still a lot of snow just to happen in a 24 hour period. As a meteorologist, have you experienced anything like this before? I was because Adam's no. from down south. Yeah. No, I, well, I worked down south. Yeah. I'm, I'm from Indiana. Indiana. I, I, I had this like vision of a really fun snowstorm as a kid where we didn't go to school for like a month. <laughs> right, right. This but is, as but, a meteorologist, no, 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 no. no, no. Oh, this, this will be is, fun for you then, too. Yeah, it's, it's already been fun. All Good. right. Well, uh, back to the weather center. All right. <laughs> Adam's going to have you covered uh, for the next 36 hours, yep. so keep it right here. Folks. All right. We love being with you every morning. We'll see you at 6 a.m. on Tuesday. You made it through your Monday. One down.